The Senate held hearings this week with the acting director of the secret service and a lot of the Republicans and even some of the Democrats, uh, grilled the acting director pretty hard about all of the failures surrounding the shooting that took place at that Trump rally two and a half weeks ago. And that of course was a tragedy. A man is dead. Corey Compratore is dead. This should not have been able to happen. I don't care what your feelings are about any of these folks. This should not have happened and it should not have been able to happen. And yes, there were failures all around, but for Donald Trump, it's not just enough that there were failures, right? He doesn't think there were failures. In fact, according to a post that Donald Trump reposted on truth social this week, he thinks there's something more sinister happening. Donald Trump reposted a meme from another truth social user that featured a picture of FBI director, Christopher Ray with a caption that read, and again, Trump reshared this caption read, what did you know? And when did you know about it? Re truth. If you want to know who ordered the assassination of Donald J Trump. So here you have Donald Trump on the social media platform that he owns suggesting that the FBI ordered the shooter to go to the Trump rally, that this was some kind of inside job from the FBI. Th this, this is beyond insane. And here's the thing about it, right? After it happened, the day after it happened, I got on here, I did a live stream and I talked about the fact that this is probably going to give Donald Trump a huge bump. Hell, it could mean that he wins the election now because of what happened. People will have sympathy for him. And I'm happy to admit, and I've already admitted previously, I was totally wrong about that. Of course, that was before Biden dropped out. But even before Biden dropped out, Donald Trump didn't get the sympathy bounce, just like he didn't get the convention bounce. But if you're going to go out there, because I know there are still some people in this country who may not like you, but do have a lot of sympathy for what happened at that rally. When you start pushing these conspiracy theories that somehow this was an inside job from the FBI, you've just lost any and all sympathy that anyone may have possibly had for you. You've gone into full on bonkers territory at this point, Donald. And what's funnier to me is that anytime Trump people, which of course the shooter was a Republican. Anytime Trump people do something bad, it's always somehow an inside job from the FBI, right? Whether it's the shooter at the rally or the Capitol riot, it was the FBI did it. Oh, the FBI instigated the FBI had, you know, secret agents in the crowd at the stop the steel rally. And then they got everybody energized to go storm the Capitol. That's not what happened. But anytime you see Republicans, including Donald Trump, tell you that the FBI is behind something, you'd better believe that it was probably a Republican who did something horrible because that is their go-to when their side does bad things that nope, it wasn't us clearly had to have been the FBI. It is a coping mechanism, but more importantly, it is a blatant lie that they are telling to try to get people to think, Hey, maybe we're not so bad. No, you are. And of course, the FBI did not in any way get involved in what happened at that rally. Were there failures all around from the secret service? hundred percent. Hell yeah. But just because people failed doesn't mean there's a grand conspiracy behind it all. Hi everyone. This here is little Athena and Athena would like to know why you haven't subscribed to fair and balanced yet. So please don't let Athena down. Subscribe today.